think there's a lot of power in numbers. And I think uh, the best statement that you can make is say that you actually have a problem with what's going on and you don't want to be used as a pawn in anybody's game. Okay, I am not a prop. You can't prop me up as your entertainment. You can't prop me up as your driver. You can't prop me up to sing and rap and do the things that I do and do comedy and, and, and decide to overlook the gifts and the talents uh, that, that African Americans bring to Hollywood specifically. So, you know, I'm not asking that man to step down uh, and, and not feed his family. I'm not asking that man to, to, to disrespect the contract that I'm sure he has with the Oscars organization. I'm asking him to step down and make a statement. Um, if, I decide, if, I, if I find out that over here at this nightclub, they're raping, abusing, and attacking women. I'm not a woman. I'm not going to be raped, abused, and attacked. But why would I? Why would I go to that club? Why would I go hang out at that nightclub when I have a problem with what they're doing to women? So sometimes you stay away from things to make a statement. So I love Chris Rock. I'm a big fan. I've never had an issue with that man, and I don't have an issue with him now. I got a problem with the fact that he's deciding to move forward and host the the Oscars. Um, and he doesn't recognize that he's being used as a pawn in somebody's game. So I'm sure he's going to crack his jokes and uh, make, make use of this, this stage to, to make his political statements. And I may not have the influence to influence that man to step down. But you don't, you don't run into a, a building that's burning. What's up, y'all? Y'all know what y'all doing. Keep it locked right here.